All right, in this video, I'll be showing you how you can sync your Brave browser across all your devices so that um, whatever you do on one device is going to reflect on another device. So I'm going to start with the phone. You open Brave browser on your phone and then you tap on this button down here. Next, you tap settings. Then you come down here to this sync option and tap it. And um, now you're going to tap add new device. So if you want to add a mobile device, you tap here. If you wish to add a computer, you tap this one. So I'll tap add a computer. And although you can't see what is being displayed, it's a password that you have to input in the Brave browser on your PC so that it knows that, um, yeah, you are the actual owner. So now I have the Brave browser opened on my computer because I want to sync it to my computer. Now I'm going to click here and then I'll click settings. There's also a sync option here, but let's just go through settings. Then click sync and next you click on this. Next you click I have a sync code. So the code that is on the phone, which you cannot see because it's a password. I'm not supposed to share it and you're not supposed to share it with anybody. So this is what you're going to have to type here. And um, once you're done, you just click confirm. So I'm going to do that now. Okay, so I'm done typing out the code and Next, I'm going to click Confirm, and then I'm going to click OK. So if I click this, you'll see now that uh, I have my device here in the list of um, devices. And if I switch to my phone, and I tap Done, you'll see over here that I have my PC as well connected to my phone. So one more setting that I'll suggest you carry out is the data preferences. So just tap on it and make sure sync everything this button here is enabled. So right now it is enabled, but if yours is disabled, I'll suggest you enable it. And also do the same on the computer. So I'll click sync everything and that should be all. So that is how you sync your Brave browser across devices. If you wish to remove a device, you click here to remove it. And you also remove the device from the phone itself. So by clicking on this trash can icon over here. But besides that, yeah, if you guys have questions, leave them in the comments and I'll be seeing you guys in the next video.